Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Oh my god, it has been a while. <laughs> so as you guys know, I went to New York and I had a blast. It was the best experience ever. If you guys ever have a chance to go, go. I think it's something that everyone should experience. I just got back a few days ago and I already want to go back. <laughs> and then after I got back from New York, I started feeling really crappy and I just did not have the energy to do anything. So that's why I haven't filmed in a while. I'm really sorry for the lack of videos, but I am so happy to be back. So I thought we'd bring it back with Legacy, of course. I always have to bring it back with Legacy. It's my favorite Let's Play. Um, sorry, I'm still feeling really crappy. I actually thought today was my first day of school, so I got up at 6.30 and I went all the way to school only to find out that it's Martin Luther King Day. So I didn't have school today. <laughs> when I got to school and I saw the parking lot empty, I was like, bro, are you kidding me? No! <laughs> but it's all good. Now I have extra time to film. So let's get into this episode of Legacy Challenge. I'm very excited. I hope you guys are too. All right, guys, here we are back on the lot. It looks like all the snow melted. So now you guys can see the pathways and all the pretty plants. Yay! <laughs> uh, so let's see what's going on. Charlie is working out? What? I'm sorry, aren't you supposed to be lazy? Huh, yeah. very interesting. Chicago. Very, very interesting. Uh, what else is going on? Hello? Where is everybody? Ah, here's Ren. Typical. She's always on the swings every time we start an episode. Look at all of our, um... Thingies are broken. Repair, 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 repair. <laughs> repair, repair. All right. Um, what's Olive doing? She's asleep. Cool, cool. And then we've got baby Alice. If you guys missed the last episode, this is Ren's baby, finally. Um, I never thought this day would come, but here she is, and she's freaking beautiful. Uh, I'm very excited to see what she looks like when she ages up, but we got a little bit of time because she just uh, aged up to a toddler, which sucks because I freaking hate toddlers in The Sims, but it is what it is. So in this episode, I thought we would just play um get some legacy points going on because we haven't really been focusing on that uh let me see how are your skills my love one 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 two okay <laughs> she needs to be potty trained oh no wait what's going on here why are you nauseous okay it must have been something you ate hey 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 no making a mess no you are not going to be that type Calmly ask not to make a mess. Clean it up. And then potty train Alice. Where is she off to? Babble. Okay. Well, come on and get potty trained. Good girl. There you go. Some encouragement, yes. Uh, look at all these maxed out skills with Ren. That's so crazy. She's almost maxed out her parenting. And then we need to do her rocket science skill. We're doing good with her. We're doing real good. How are you? Why are you dazed? Sad? Drunk? Did we have a party? Is this the aftermath of the party? You know what? I think it is. Yikes. Okay. Well. <laughs> um. How's your work going? Reach level 5 painting. I'm pretty sure we already are level 5 painting. Is this glitch really going to prevent us from getting a promotion? Let me actually see something really quick. What if we cheated her skills? Actually, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, is she almost, what is she? She's halfway, okay. Hmm. All right, well, let's get that up to level seven. Uh-oh, Olive is no longer a celebrity. It's okay, that wasn't really our goal for her anyway. And we have $13,000 of bills. Wow. Why is everyone so... Oh my god. Excruciatingly fatigued from working out. 
Why the heck did you work out then? I did not make you do that. Okay, Ren just reached level nine parenting. I'm gonna get her to hibernate since her stupid butt was outside for so long that she started to sizzle. Aww, what's going on here? Isn't that cute? Hmm, what can we do with you? Can we do, uh, like flash cards? Flash cards, teach basic needs. Ooh, what's this from? First kiss. Oh, yeah, Allie. Okay, so, um, yeah. I wanted her to be with Allie. However, there is a uh, huge problem with that. He's an elder. Oh, the bunny's here. Please, please, uh, uh, sprinkle your magic dust on our crops. Oh. You're lusting over Olive? That's interesting. <gasps> Um, yeah, so he's an elder, so I don't think that's gonna work out. I like him a lot, though, but no, mm-mm. I mean, Olive is, she has 15 more days as an adult, so yeah, I don't think that's gonna work. And then some of you guys said that you wanted to see Patchy's baby, and I thought that was such an interesting idea. Oh, and one of you guys said um, she should have a baby with Patchy, and it should be a plant sim. And I thought that was such a cool idea. So we might go along with that. Oh, and a lot of you guys really liked Fallon, this guy here. Um, you think that his unflirty and paranoid traits are a perfect match for Olive just because, um, because he's unflirty, Olive doesn't have to worry about, uh, him cheating on her. Like, her paranoid, she's so paranoid that her new boyfriend or whatever is gonna cheat on her because she has a paranoid trait. But if he's unflirty, then she doesn't have to worry about that. And he's paranoid too, so I feel like they would just, I don't know, get along? My darling, if you're so tired, sleep, please. I'm not really sure what to do about Olive, but uh, I'm, I'm, I'm either leaning towards Fallon or towards her having a baby with Patchy and making it a plant sim. Wow, you threw a great charity benefit party or the talk of the town and you did a good deed? When did we throw a charity party? I haven't played this in like weeks. I'm confused. So confused. Saw something today that reminded me of you. Well, isn't that sweet? Little childhood buds. That's cute. I like that. Who's calling you, Charlie? Is it the principal? Oh, Lord. What? What is it? Oh, my God. We didn't go to school today. Well, it's Easter. Why would he be calling us on Easter. I'm confused. I'm confused. Maybe you should... What the heck is this? Flower arrangement? Who gave you a flower arrangement? That's really cute. If I'm not careful, I could drop a grade. Well, okay. You did your homework, so that's good. That's all you can really do as of right now. But, uh... Go ahead and do a stream so you can maintain that celebrity level. Oh my god, you're unknown. You're not you don't even have a star yet. That emotional control though. Oh my god. That's horrible. One day? Wait, your birthday's in one day? Okay. So we need to work on your responsibility then. Um just so you can have that at least. Some of you guys said that kind of conflicts with his laziness, but uh, I didn't even try to do this. It just happened, so he must really want to be responsible. <laughs> There's just trash everywhere, too. It's, gross. it's still very dirty from the party as well. Wasn't the maid just here? Oh, we don't have a maid. Wait, do we? The gardener finally aged up. Aww. How sad. All right, I'm going to get Alice up and have her hunt for some eggs just because that is a very um, little baby thing for her to do. So she's just having herself some chili right now. And then we can have her talk to the bunny. Hi, bun bun. <laughs> huh? 
hunt for egg, hunt for egg, we are hunting for eggs, and it's Charlie's birthday. Okay, I suppose we can uh, throw him a party tomorrow. Yay! Hurry, hurry, there's only 15 minutes left of, of egg day! Egg day was awful. I'm, well, Alice had a good time. That's all that really matters. I'm just gonna get her to go potty. Um, I'm just so annoyed how dirty the house is and it's doing that thing where I can't drag the plates and it's driving me crazy. Ren, it's time for you to get up. Time for you to clean up the house. All right, so she got her skill, her painting skill up to level seven. Did it register in the job? It did not. Okay, so let's try something. Let's uh, go to MC Command Center and change her skills to, let's change it to four again. Okay, four. Why is it still seven? It's still not registering. Ugh, that's so annoying. I don't understand. Oh well, could try and get her promoted without it. All right, so Olive is off to work. Charlie is at school. Ren is working on her rocket science skill. Um, we want to throw a party tonight for Charlie, so we're gonna do that. Hopefully, he is responsible by the time he gets home just so he'll have that uh, upbringing trait. Okay, it looks like Charlie is still a B student, so that's good, it didn't drop. But he's having a mood swing. Shoot, um, go ahead and go to bed. I really don't wanna deal with that mood swing right now. Ooh, ooh, gain a million simoleons in a single household. We did it, guys. We made a million dollars. That's crazy. All right, so for Charlie, I'm gonna get Ren to make him a blue confetti cake. Charlie, how's your mood? Oh, you have plenty of energy, which is great. You just need to use the bathroom. Take an angry poop. Take a cold shower. Try to get a little bit less enraged. And then we can invite your friends over for you to age up. Let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's start a gathering. Okay, now who else do we want to invite? Let's invite Lilith. Only the um, close people. Uh, his dad, of course. Oliver. Let's do Dorian. Let's do Max Jr. Oh, he can't come. Oh, right, and you guys told me to lock the uh, the bedroom doors for everyone but household members. So yeah, we're doing that. <laughs> I don't want any woohoos to happen again. Okay, it looks like people are starting to show up. Who's that? Pretty sure I didn't invite you, but okay. Look who it is! It's freaking Dorian! I love him. He's adorable. One of my favorite sims, for sure. This child. Oh my gosh. She needs a bath. Ren, that's all you. There you go. Okay, what's going on over here? The heck? What are you doing? Seriously, Oliver, clean that up. Oh, what the? Um, excuse you. Who is this? A freaking Kingston. Typical. Just typical. Where's your drone? You need to be streaming this. It's your birthday party. Oh my god, it's gonna be so difficult to find it. Drone. Where are you? Maybe we should buy like multiple and just have them be around everywhere. Ah, there it is. All right, begin stream. Why are the lights off? There, that's better. Why don't you begin stream and then do something stupid with uh, Kingston? 
Scare him. So what a new lord. <sighs> 8,500 followers. Not bad, but where is everyone else? You go, Olive. You feeling yourself or what? <laughs> okay, um, where is everybody? I know we invited a bunch more people. Okay, uh, there's Lucas. Oh, they're all in the orchard for- what is happening out here? What's going on? Hmm. Did I miss something? Dorian? You making moves on our girl? Oh, no, he's leaving. Okay, I'll see you later. Um, alright, Charlie. Are you responsible yet? I don't want to age you up until you're responsible. Okay, let's just get you to brush your teeth a bunch of times. Oh no! He aged up on his own! <laughs> oh my god, I'm so annoyed. I am so annoyed and he wasn't even responsible. Oh! <sighs> okay, well that's annoying. Uh, shoot. Alright, so Olive is cheerful, a geek, and paranoid, and Orange is jealous, outgoing, and loves the outdoors. And his child trait was lazy, right? Yeah. Okay, cheerful and lazy. That cheerful, cheerful trait is getting passed down to like every generation from um, Zara, which I think is pretty cool. Okay, let's find out his last trait. I'm scared. I'm scared! Geek. I swear, I swear, I swear. Can we get some, like, new traits? He didn't get any traits from Orange. Which makes sense because Olive is pretty much the one who raised him. But still. I want something different. Alright, so he is... He wants a big happy family. He's cheerful, lazy, and a geek. There you go. Oh my god, he didn't get any positive upbringing traits. He was so close to, but he didn't get any of them. He just got un uncontrolled emotions. <laughs> dang it. Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. Are you sad? Are you sad from... Yeah, you are. But you have a cake right here! Whatever. We'll just put it away. Just put it away. Can't do anything about it now. All right, so now that you are a young adult, we need to age up Stella as well. Oh, maybe we can uh, use the cake for her. There we go. All right, go ahead there, Stella. Happy birthday. Very cool. Okay, so um, I'm thinking now that he is a young adult that he should lock things down with Stella. I really like her and I really want Charlie to get married. I want him to get married and I want him to start making a family. And he's streaming all of this. Oh my gosh, offer her a rose and then... He's like struggling to stay awake, but ask her to be girlfriend before it dies. Quick! Quick, 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 do it, Charlie, do it! Yes. Yay, he did it! Just in time. Cute. Cute! Finally, a freaking relationship in this Let's Play. Jeez. Okay, uh. Cool. Oh, we need to age up Kingston, too. Uh, let's add more candles. Yay, happy birthday! Ren is teaching baby Alice to talk over here. They're so cute. What's that? 
<laughs> so cute. I love them so much. Alright. Ooh, all of reached dancing level five. That's what's up, girl. That means you maxed it. Proud of you. This is my favorite outfit of hers, too. It's so cute. Oh, thanks, Lucas, for fixing our sink. Look at this bean going potty all by herself. Good for you. Uh, okay, so how are your skills? How are they going? Um, Pretty good. Pretty good, pretty good. I'm just going to get Ren to play dolls with her for a little while. Work on her imagination skill. There's so much going on. Ah, go to work. Yes, absolutely go to work. Answer the phone. Go ahead and chat with Oliver. Um, Charlie? I think we decided that we weren't going to get you a job, that you were just going to live off the family money, which isn't exactly a good thing, but... Yeah, that's what we decided on. Oh, excuse me. I forgot that the club gathering was still going on. You can end that. Goodbye, everybody. Have a good day. Thanks for coming to my birthday. What is this bean doing in here? Ew, what is this big pile of nastiness? Go away. Where are you going? Eat cake? No. No, no, no. No cake for you. Put it down. So something that we could do for a legacy point is... Where is it? Cook a meal with two perfect quality fresh ingredients. Perfect quality? Is that a thing? Does that mean the plant has to be like, the bar needs to be all the way full? Because the quality is magnificent. So I'm thinking that's not good enough. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> yeah, the quality of this is now perfect. So yeah. So we, can, we have dragon fruits and strawberries. I wonder if we can make a pie from that. Come and harvest everything from this bush. Three snapdragons and one strawberry. <clears throat> okay, hold the phone. Wait a minute, no, you can't cook with snapdragons. What am I thinking? Ooh, this pear tree is perfect quality, but it's out of season right now. That's gonna be really, really hard. We'll need like a perfect onion and a perfect mushroom or a perfect carrot and a perfect potato or perfect tomato, perfect garlic. And our vegetable plants, they're like nowhere near to being perfect yet. Um, I mean, these mushrooms, they are well on their way. I mean, we're pretty close. So we can do a mushroom and then what was the other thing that we needed? Like an onion? How are onion plants? They're nice. That's unfortunate. Well, we'll keep working towards that. Hopefully we can get that soon. Um, have a sim make date excellent meal or drink during a single date. We can do that with Caleb. Let's see. How's your mood? Really low. Why is it so low? Why is it always so low, Ren? Why? Well, when she feels better, we can invite Caleb over for a date, and we can do that. Uh, what else can we do? Potions of youth. Okay, I totally forgot about that. How many do we currently have? I think they're all right here, right? Potion of youth. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh no! Charlie didn't get an A in high school, so Olive's not gonna get her aspiration. Oh no! <laughs> She definitely needs to have another kid, but she's going to be an elder. Oh no, she's got plenty of time. Hmm. This is getting hard, not going to lie. You know what sucks about this let's play? I don't think we've con we've completed an aspiration yet and we're already on generation 4. 
Well, technically we're still on three, but no, we're on four now because Charlie's a young adult. <gasps> okay. Okay, I need to get my um, stuff together because I didn't realize how far behind we were. You guys, what the heck? I was just looking at friends' relationships and Caleb got married to someone named Rosemary. Okay. I was planning on having her and Caleb like be a thing and be together, but since he got married to someone else, I'm kind of thinking maybe he just like maybe um Lilith explained to him about how Ren was trying so hard to have a kid and she was just failing with every uh option she tried and maybe he was like I'll help her I'll be a donor and maybe since I'm a vampire it will work and it did so yeah that pretty much answers that question uh Caleb was just a sperm donor for Ren and they are just friends now because Caleb got married <sighs> I hate the Sims sometimes. Like, what the heck? Okay, well. <laughs> That's really very sad. Well, that is that. There's nothing we can do about that. I'm gonna get Lilith to come over and help Ren with her vampire stuff. Olive, um, you've got work in 21 hours, so we'll send you. Um, she needs to have another kid. And then for Charlie's aspiration, he wants to become a parent. He wants to read to his kid and socialize with his kid. So I think Stella's the one. Um, we're going to have to get their... Oh, their relationship is actually really high. That's good. So we'll probably get them married soon. I also want her and Lilith to become best friends, so let's go ahead, get that done. Okay, cool, best friends they are. Uh, I want you guys to do more vampire stuff. Request training. Hey, look who showed up. What's up, Max? Um, let's invite him in. Why not? How's Alice doing? She's still sleeping, you poor dear. I'm gonna get Charlie to study trends and do a video today. Video gaming, sad vlog, toy review, and painting. Are you going out tomorrow? I, I don't know, am I? Uh, let's do a toy review. Wait, who has a refined plate palette? Olive, shoot, 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 shoot. Oh well. <laughs> Can we purchase a lottery ticket in the Legacy Challenge? I can't remember. Okay, toy review video. Um, let's just say he did a review on his streaming drone. And upload. Charlie's most recent video that Charlie recorded is Catching Waves and has been nominated for an award. Check out the next award ceremony Sunday at 7 to see if he won. Wow. I doubt we're going to remember that, but leave a drawing for someone on the bulletin board. That's so cute. Do we even have a bulletin board? I don't think that would be popping up if we didn't, but I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm not seeing one. Ren, can you do something productive? I might have to delete the swings. She doesn't do anything except for swing, and it's kind of infuriating. Just because I want her to do something else. Yo, Charlie, please stop working out. Seriously, you're gonna be pissed at yourself. You were excruciatingly uh, pissed off after the last time you worked out. My darling, good morning! What are you eating? Please don't tell me it's spoiled. Are you... No, don't. Don't eat that. No! Um, I don't want you to have cake either. Okay, hang on. Just, just come over here and then we can have... Oh my god, there's no food in here either. 
All right, uh, Olive, can you get food for her? Let's get her a ham and cheese sandwich. All right, there you go. All better now. When she matches her sandwich. <laughs> no! Oh my god. Olive can write a love email. Let's write one to Fallon and see how he responds. That would be really cute. <gasps> She's like, I know we just met, but I feel like we hit it off really, really, really well. I was wondering if you feel the same way about me. Let me know. Write back, lol. Oh my god! Look at that! Look at that! Ro they had no romance and now they have ha like almost half a bar of romance just from a love email? Wow. That's pretty amazing. I'm so sorry that my face cam keeps cutting out. Uh, since I got this new camera- look <laughs> This is funny. Since I got this new camera, um... It doesn't let me know when it stops recording, so, uh, yeah, I just- I realize it once I, like, look. But I'm not always looking at the screen. So, yeah, it is what it is. Sorry about it. You guys were saying that even though she has level 15 vampire lore skill, if she reads the books, it's, it increases her vampire rank. So, let's see, do we even have a bookcase in here? <laughs> I don't think we do. This isn't exactly a family that reads. Is there one in Ren's house? All right, I snagged one. Let's see. Let's see if there is a vampire book in here. There is. Okay, let's try reading that and see if it increases her vampire swank thing. Okay, it's not going up. So... Oh, yeah it is. That's great, that's great, that's great, that's great. Okay, great. Well, you keep reading that. Aw, Charlie's reading Alice's story. I didn't even tell him to do that. But could you sit any further away? <laughs> I think we should probably hire a maid since these sims are so freaking dirty. No one ever wants to, uh, clean up after themselves so we had a maid i don't remember what happened to him what's going on here are they broken oh no. <laughs> he's like i want to be a dad so bad <laughs> what the heck is he saying, I wonder? Oh my god, my heart! They're so cute! I legit don't even know what Alice is to Charlie. Like... It's so... Okay, so he is... His grandpa's sister's daughter. So... Would that make them- His grandpa's sister's daughter. So his great aunt's daughter. Okay, so they are cousins. They're first cousins. Okay. That's what I thought. Very strange. Very strange indeed. Girl, what? Oh my god, you pissed me off. Eee, so cute! Where are you off to? He's like, hey, Oliver, have you met Alice yet? Patchy, no, it's spoiled. Don't do it, my dude. Whatever you're made of straw, I doubt it affects you anyway. Got, we're do we got some flashcards going on. Ren is hibernating because all of her vampire energy got drained from the sun. All is at work. Charlie's doing flashcards. I'm sorry this episode is really uh, low key. Um, we did need to like work on relationships and work on skills a little bit and take a break from all the drama. This is a nice family day. 
It's really annoying how I can't drag the stuff to the trash. I don't know why it does that sometimes. Oh yeah, she got promoted, even though it didn't register her painting skill. Yes, she will now make an additional 85 per hour. And she received a bonus. Wow, good job, Olive. Good job. Look at her, all energized, even though she's exhausted. What do you have to do? Pick up, pick up Alice. That's all anyone wants to do. She's such a spoiled baby. So what level of career are you? Eight. That's what's up. So she needs level level eight writing, level seven charisma. Okay, we can definitely do that. Francesca Landgrab. Wow, you married a Landgrab? Which Landgrab, I wonder? Don't you know? Ren knows you, so let's have a look. I always love seeing who everyone ends up with. It's very funny. Francesca, there we go. Malcolm Landgrab. I'm not sure which Landgrab that is, but... Charlie's just reading Alice a little bedtime story, of course, while streaming. This drone. It sees it all, I swear. <laughs> I'm having Olive practice her writing, and then... Uh, Ren is hibernating to get her energy back up. It honestly takes a lot to keep her vampire energy up. It's kind of annoying. Oh my god, what is with this? You guys are so messy! Keep reading this vampire book so you can get your rank up. And look, she's got seven power points now? Whoa, maybe we should spend some. Let's get one of these. Become stronger in the nighttime. Alright, Charlie, um, what skills should we work on with you? Probably your charisma skill, since, um... Since you're gonna be like a famous like YouTuber or TikTok star, I kind of feel like you need pretty good charisma for that type of thing. So everyone's just skill building. Alice is asleep. Pretty um, productive episode, I'd say. And it's love day. I hate love day. But I guess we can uh, go on dates with all of everyone's lovers. Oh, but Ren doesn't have a lover anymore. Oh no! <laughs> that sucks, that's so sad. Ooh, Ren is now a master vampire, y'all. That's what I'm talking about, and it was only from reading books. You guys were right. Olive's late for work, but I really want her to get that skill up before she goes, and oh my god, look who's here, guys. <sighs> Do we want Caleb in our life? It's kind of a slippery slope. Cause he just donated his um his uh, daddy stuff, so I don't know. I don't know. It's all so confusing. Can we oh yeah, she leveled up, so we can get something new. What should we get? Ooh, the sun resistance! Yes, this is what we need. Yep. Oh, this supernatural speed thing is what L Lilith and Caleb have. Odorless? Oh, that's sick. But no, we definitely need the sun resistance. Greater sun resistance is what we have. So, the sun's rays are a disastrous downside of the vampiric path. With greater sun resistance, Ren is more impervious to the sun's cursed, cursed effects, but she will still be wary and cautious during the daytime hours. Okay, cool. So this is what we need for her to complete her aspiration. So we just need to level up one more time. Oh, but we need to take on a weakness? Shoot. Uh, Ren doesn't really eat human food, does she? Let's just get that one. That doesn't really uh, affect her that much. Kengo! Hi! Well, I guess Olive just isn't coming- or isn't going to work today. Uh, maybe she should call in. Okay, she's going anyway. Alright, uh, you're only gonna be there for a few hours, but I guess something is better than nothing. I really want to go on vacation? That's weird. I mean, I guess we can. Maybe we can do that in the next episode. It'll be a vacation episode. 
Yay, yeah, Ren Max the parenting skill! You go, girl. What's next? Rocket science. Okay, cool. Go ahead. Continue improving maneuvering thrusts. Alice, your communication's getting there. It's pretty good. It's your thinking that's lacking. So why don't you come and do some sim shape on the tablet? There she goes. Good girl. There you go. She maxed the rocket science skill. It's not brain surgery. Good job, love. Good job. Hello, I am back. <laughs> ah, all right. Oh, it's Love Day. Shoot, it's almost over. No. I'm so bad with holidays, but I just like lose track of time. There's just other important things going on. Ain't nobody got time for Love Day. You know what I mean? So to end this episode, we're going to age up uh, darling little Alice here. We're going to see what she looks like as a child, and that'll be it for today. Um, I know it was kind of a boring episode, but we got to have one of these every once in a while. Oh my god! You guys, Billy died! I saw that Ren was sad, and I was like, wait, why? Is it because she was mourning Max? But no, Billy died! I had no idea she was an elder. That's crazy. Poor girl. Okay, well Alice's skills are pretty good. She maxed her communication, her movement, and her potty. Her imagination didn't get there and neither did her thinking, but she's gonna age up today. So I don't want what happened to Charlie to happen to her. So everyone, come on over here. Ren, help blow out candles. Alice, and let's get this show on the road, shall we? I can't believe it's her birthday. Wait, wait, wait! Hold on, I need to refresh myself of their traits first before I age her up. So Ren is, geez, look at all these. She is a goofball, a dog lover, and a child of the ocean. And then Caleb, oh my god, of course, unknown traits. I'll have to look it up. Okay. He's, let me write this down, <laughs> a foodie, which is pretty funny because he's a vampire. Uh, he is ambitious and materialistic. Interesting. I'm very, very, very curious to see what she gets. Oh. Happy birthday. Oh. oh. Where'd she go? I was like, bro, the kid. All right, here we go. Alice's first trait is child of the ocean. <laughs> okay, child of the ocean and her aspiration is whiz kid. All right, well, that doesn't really make any sense just because Ren has never been to the ocean. But okay, sure, whatever. It is what it is, I guess. Okay. Yes, what is it? Oh no! Alexander passed away now. Oh my gosh, I mean, it's about time. Max passed away a while ago, but he lived for quite some time. Poor Dorian. How old is Dorian now? He's still a young adult, right? Oh, he's a teen. Hmm. Well, maybe now that his dad passed away, he'll want to move out. Maybe he can move in with Oliver. I think that would be cool. Alright, one thing at a time. Let's have a look at uh, Alice and create a sim. Really, really excited to see uh, how she turned out. Also kind of nervous, not gonna lie. Hi, cutie. 
Aww, okay. She's real cute. I love the moles. Okay, let's just um take the glasses off for now. Take the hair. Okay. I don't really see that much Ren in her. All right, guys. 800 million, 5,008 minutes later. <laughs> I finally finished Alice. This is what I decided on. I love this hair with the... Uh, accessories i think it's so cute but yeah she's really 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 pretty and i'll show you her outfits um here's number one of her every day number two definitely more casual number three i love this i love this so much it's so um spellcaster i wish you could be a spellcaster but i don't think you can when you're a vampire here's number four this is so cute I'm obsessed with it. And number five. I also love this a lot too. Uh, this is her formal wear. Super cute. Her active. Her sleep. I, f I kind of feel like she's the type of girl that's into Halloween like year round. So yeah. That's what we're doing. Here's her party wear. Her swim her hot weather clothes, and her cold weather clothes. I decided to use these ginormous boots because, oh no, they're clipping! Oh man. Oh well, I'm keeping them anyway because I like them. Okay guys, I'm gonna leave this episode right here because I have been recording for a very long time because I did a lot of skill building off camera. I hope you like her though. Make sure to leave me a comment and let me know what you think. Let me know what you think about all this situation. Do you want her to have a plant baby with Patchy or do you want her to get with Fallon and have a kid with him? And yeah, just in general, let me know in the comments what you guys would like to see. I know this episode was a little bit more low key than usual, but the skill building was definitely needed. <laughs> I love you guys so much. I'm so happy to be back. I hope you guys are happy too. And I will see you in the next video. Love you. Bye.